My name is Travis Linz and this is my conversion kit for Michael Herkus. It is January 7th and I will get this mailed out tomorrow. Um, use this as an installation reference guide. So going through the components, the first component we have is the flat plate heat exchanger. And um, we have two of these and the coolant runs in here and basically through the heat exchanger and then out the other side. So the typical coolant going to your heater core and um, the heater hose would typically fit on here. Um, and you can daisy chain it through both of them. And then the vegetable oil comes from the pump that you provide into this outlet here and then it runs through the heat exchanger, through the flat plates, non-contact, and then out of the heat exchanger from this port, or vice versa. It doesn't really matter which direction it flows. And then from here, you run into the inlet of my strainer filter combination. Now this is a very effective filter, the strainer, um, the stainless steel, you can just clean it and it'll last forever. Uh, having this makes your filters last very long. And you just screw off the 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 valve or the plastic cover to access the filters. You can get a special wrench for it, but I find you can just just don't over tighten it. And you can always get it off by hand. And then you have these drain ports where you can drain any accumulated water off the bottom. And you can also use these for purging when you flip it upside down. Anyway, you come out of the strainer filter combination, and then we go into the pump. Um, the pump has a direction arrow on it, and basically you will just go through the pump in out of here into there and uh, out of here and into the second flat plate heat exchanger. And then same thing, you run through here, in and out, and the coolant in and out as well. That actually is proven more effective if you have counter flow. So if you have the coolant running in this direction, you want the oil running in the opposite direction, but very minor difference, doesn't really matter very much. So you'll come out of the second flat plate heat exchanger, out of this port, and you'll go into the middle port of the three-way valve, which switches the fuels. And that middle port you see is labeled veg. So that's where the vegetable oil goes into. And then on this three-way port, this one here labeled dye for diesel. The diesel runs into here, your standard diesel supply. And this one for IP for injection pump is a line that goes directly to your injection pump. And then we will also take your fuel return and T it into the same line that goes to the injection pump. So it'll come from here through the T and this will go to the pump and then the fuel return line will go right into here. So it just loops it around. It works very effectively. And um, simple little uh, switch unit. Uh, in the conduit box, um, uh, basically veg oil here, so this switches on and off vegetable oil, and then I have an override for the pump. So you turn this one on, and the valve switches, light comes on. You can hear it's a slight click. Um, and then the second one is for the pump. And you hear the pump pumping over here. So typically you would just leave the pump on all the time, and then you just use this to turn on and off. So you, you're ready, your engine's up to temperature, you want to switch to vegetable oil, you just pull the switch. That thing switches, you're on vegetable oil, the pump turns on. And then you're, you're done, you turn off, and then you drive around three miles to purge out the fuel. And then this switch more is if you want to override for when you purge the fuel. If you want to leave it on vegetable oil, but you're purging, you can turn that off, and then just turn it on until you purge out the air and then turn it off. So it just gives you that control. But typically, you should just always leave that on, so that way it both turns it both on. So I also provided in the kit, I got a spare filter, spare... Uh, um, seal for the filter, fuse holder, fuses, two extra fittings, um, 